Retired economist, and uh, I do collages now. So I'm becoming very fond of the senior program, which I am now part of at 58 years old. You know, life's changing for me, but uh, I've been exercising and working it out. So I don't yet have that, you know, sedentary lifestyle which I was trying to lay into after my father passed. So exercise is great. And I'm a budding artist. I found an art program. Oh, good. So why don't you start off by just telling everybody how you got started as an artist. I think that's always fascinating. Ooh. Well, I guess, you know, coloring. And uh, just always like to draw. And um, I was very fortunate to have a father that loved to spend time with me, so we would go visit the museums and galleries in Washington, D.C. on Sundays. Mm. So I was exposed to a lot of art very early on, and um, just always liked to, to draw. Mm. Uh, my uh, late husband was uh, studied at the School of Visual Arts in New York City, and he was my mentor. So I really got all mm. my technical expertise through him over the years um, and I took a couple of courses at UDC, a 2D and a 3D course with uh, Yvonne Carter oh, and that. aside from that I've just really just been working and being very critical about one of them but what do you use as your inspirational jumping off place because some of these older paintings have a particular theme that maybe you can talk about I might get an idea uh, and sketch it out. I wouldn't call myself uh, uh, one who really does a lot of illustrations, but I'll do something rough just to get an idea of what it is that I want to uh, develop. And it may, it may come out looking like what I started out with, and it may not. I don't restrict myself to, okay, well, this is what I started with. If it does, I go with the flow. Mm -hmm. Um, and there's certain images that I really get a big kick out of. You'll see a lot of children work, um, uh, lovers, angels, uh, musicians. I do a lot of acting. Her work. I collect her work. Her work is very collectible. And I'm looking forward to doing a workshop with her. You want to play. I, I know that. <laughs> <laughs> colors down there? Yeah. How's that? Better? Orange? Orange Just know that it's not be aware. Yeah. 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 yeah, we've got purple scissors out to share, so share some. Yeah. Really brave. Switch back to your dominant hand and close your eyes. And right like this. So we yes or no in one hand. Now, I've been standing throughout this whole thing, and that's kind of my MO. When I'm making an art, I should stand up. over here. This one I did, this was originally just um, an oil painting. 
and it didn't work for me. And I thought, okay, I'm going to add some mixed media to it. So I was just playing with where the, um, the different angles of the pool table. I've done a number of pieces of, of myself and my late husband. And it was really, we'd been together for 31 years, so it was really quite traumatic. Um, the last piece I did about us, I call it Ending the Journey. And when I was preparing it for the show, I was looking for my signature, and I discovered I had signed it upside down. I didn't do that intentionally, but I think I was so... Um, and, um, a friend came over, she's an artist, I said, what you think about it? Because I, I, I'm from the um, comments and criticism school. Tell me what you thought of the show. What did you think of it? I thought the show was fabulous. I've known uh, Jenny for many, many years, and I've always been a fan of her art. But over the last few years, her art has evolved. In a, in a very powerful and striking way. And I just thought today's exhibit was fabulous. Okay. I think the show's amazing. She's an awesome artist. I love seeing women of color portrayed in such a wonderful fashion. Great. What did you think of the uh, show? I love the little ebony square uh, collages that she's done. They just really pop. Right. Well, when I saw this today, Great. How inspiring and how creative and how versatile the art is, and we were just so impressed with the artist. What do you think of the show? I love this exhibition. I know Miss Glover. I have not seen all of her work, but I love the mixed media collage, especially how she's taken the um, the images of the faces, and then she's used swatches of fabric in here. It reminds me of. Um, Mr. Bearden, Romare Bearden. Okay. This evening, but it's really the attention to detail and the colors that are grasping me. No, no two are alike. And in an artist, you can tell it's the same artist, but no two paintings that we've seen this evening are alike. And so that's what is grabbing me this evening. It's been wonderful. Thank you. <laughs>